Glad to be back in the grand again. Now, one difference our audience may notice is there are no shin guards on these fellas. They are coming out, and they are, have no protection other than their mouthpieces, gloves, and cuffs. See Lucas coming out southpaw already. We're going to see a lot of fast action in this fight since these guys are weighing in at 150 pounds. Good. Good head kick attempt there by Chester. Lucas looking pretty solid. Derek, how much does your game plan change when you're fighting a southpaw? Oh, it changes drastically. Yeah, so One it ends up I being can't. a lot more about the footwork, right? Oh, yeah. One thing I can't stand is a southpaw. Yeah. <laughs> You've got to beat the outside lead foot. So, so if I were Chester, I'd be looking to take my left leg. I'd be stepping outside of the Good right body leg. kick there landing oh by Hill. Looks like it landed Good pretty shot. hard. He lands some damage. Referee George Connolly stepping in and calling a fight uh, to the action. And that was the quickest fight of the night so far. Lucas Hill, the winner by referee stoppage. Lucas looks solid. He did. He came out moving good. He is excited. Well, Derek, how was it commentating your first match? <laughs> it was nice. It was nice. I said like three words. You didn't get to say much, did I did you? Not, no. Lucas looked great, though, honestly. I think Chester just took a, a pretty hard shot. It looked like uh, oh, yeah. to the right eye, maybe. Yeah. And, uh, and it had him wincing pretty hard. I'm not sure exactly what happened there, but um, the unanswered punches caused referee George Conley to cause a stop to the action there. Lucas had a very fast uh, right kick, too. Fifty-three second victory is not one you see very often in kickboxing. That was the fastest kickboxing match I've ever seen, you guys. Yeah, that was a good one. It was nice. 